Hello and welcome to Video Jug. We're going to show you how to make apple strudel. Step 1. You'll need the following ingredients to serve 6 people. For the pastry, you will need 4 phyllo pastry sheets, 80 grams of breadcrumbs, 70 grams of sugar, 1 teaspoon of cinnamon, 100 grams of melted butter. For the apple filling, 110 grams of sugar, half a tablespoon of cinnamon, 35 grams of butter, 50 grams of raisins, 2 tablespoons of sliced almonds, the juice and zest from half a lemon, 7 grams of corn flour, and 5 Granny Smith apples, peeled and sliced into wedges. And a little powdered sugar on hand for presentation. Here is a handy list of the ingredients. You will also need the following utensils. Some wax paper, two bowls, a brush, a frying pan, a wooden spoon, one tray, one spoon, and a baking tray. Step 2. Preheat the oven to 200 degrees centigrade. Before starting your apple strudel, set the oven to 200 degrees centigrade. Step 3. Make the apple filling. Place a pan on a medium heat. When hot, add the butter. Let it melt and then add the apples. The apples will need to be cooked through, which will take about 7 to 10 minutes in total. Stir them occasionally. After a few minutes, add the sugar and mix again. Let it cook for about a minute more and then add the raisins, almonds and cinnamon and mix. Step 4. Add ingredients to the filling. Now combine the lemon juice, lemon zest and corn flour in a little bowl. And mix. And add them to the apple filling. Stir it in thoroughly and let it thicken. Then, remove the filling from the heat and place it on a metal tray to cool. Step 5. Mix the remaining ingredients. Into a bowl, combine the breadcrumbs, the sugar and the cinnamon. Mix well and set aside. We are now ready to begin the pastry. Step 6. Make the phyllo pastry. Place a sheet of phyllo on your workspace and brush it generously with the melted butter. Now take the cinnamon mixture and sprinkle some of it over the entire surface. Next, lay another layer of phyllo on top of the first sheet, brush it with some butter and then turn it over. Butter the second side and sprinkle it with the cinnamon mixture. Repeat this action with a third sheet. For the fourth sheet of pastry, butter both sides of the pastry, but do not add the cinnamon mixture. Now flip all four sheets of phyllo so that the first sheet is on top. Step 7. Fill and roll the phyllo pastry. Make a line with a mixture along the long edge of the pastry. Now carefully roll it into a log just as our chef is demonstrating. Step 8. Bake. Place a piece of waxed paper on a baking tray and place the strudel on top of the paper. Press each end a little and place it in the oven. Let it cook for about 20 minutes. Step 9. Remove and serve.
When it's ready, take your apple strudel out of the oven. Place it on a cutting board and sprinkle it with a bit of powdered sugar. Cut it into slices and enjoy. Apple strudel is best served hot with a little vanilla ice cream. And that's how to make apple strudel the video jug way.